Our first chapter is in seventh class, matter and its composition. So first we will start the definition of matter. What is matter? Matter is something that has some mass and occupy space. Mass means everything in this universe has some mass and everything in this universe has some volume so it occupies some space this is occupying space where i will keep this if i keep this pen in my hand it is occupying space a fixed space it is occupying you can take this object anywhere it will occupy space it needs some space to be blessed and something is contained in this that amount is called mass so this is matter now the matter exists in three states Broadly, some scientists have told that matter exists in five states, six states, but we will study only three states. Those states are solid, liquid, and gas. Three states. First, gas. Gas is the state of matter in which the molecules or the atoms or ions have large intermolecular space between them <coughs> in gaseous state. In gaseous state, the atoms are very very far from each other. Second, because of this space, they can expand large extent. Large extent they can expand. So, the intermolecular space, it is a space between the molecules of the gas substance or gas state is maximum. And because of the distance, distance is very much maximum, the force of attraction between the molecules will be less. Force of attraction means in any state of matter there is a force of attraction between the particles, the experience. In gaseous state it is very very less or you can say negligible, negligible means equals to zero. So, intermolecular space and force of attraction is clear. Now we will talk about volume. Volume of the gaseous state is not fixed. It changes according to the container. If we fill the gas in this container, the volume of the gas will become this much. If we take the same gas in another container, if we compress the gas and we can pour all the gas in this much container at high pressure so the volume is changeable not fixed if we talk about size size is also not fixed you can see the gas can be filled in a balloon and gas can be filled in a container in any container it will occupy its shape so the, these three points are clear. The next point, the gas is compressibility. Compressibility means if we compress this gas state of any substance, if this much space is any gas is occupying, if we compress the gas, then it will occupy less volume. So in gaseous state, compressibility is high or maximum. It is because 
the four uh, the space between the molecule is more so this space can be filled by the molecules if we apply pressure example of this there are many example of this oxygen co2 carbon dioxide helium hydrogen chlorine these are the gases now we come to the liquid state liquid state they have less intermolecular space than gaseous state means they are much closer as compared to the gas the molecules or the ions or particles in the liquid state are much closer as compared to the gaseous state so they experience more force of attraction between the particles as compared to gaseous state that's why they are very close force of attraction between the liquid state is much more than the gaseous state volume of the liquid state is fixed if we fill water water is a liquid state if we fill water in this container suppose it is a container then it will be filled in this and it will occupy this much volume if we pour this water in another container it will occupy the same volume suppose it is 10 ml if we pour this in any other container there also it will occupy 10 ml because volume is fixed but size is not fixed size is not fixed because if we take liquid in this container it is occupying its shape and if we pour this liquid in a glass empty glass it will occupy the shape of the glass so the shape of the liquid state is not fixed but the volume is fixed and the example of this liquid are many like water milk bromine kerosene petrol diesel these are the liquid state example solid in solid the volume is fixed always fixed we cannot compress suppose we take this pen if we compress this we can't compress it because the for, the intermolecular space in between the molecule is ne negligible there is no space between the molecules in between the molecules of the solid state force of attraction is maximum so they can occupy very less space as compared to liquid or gas it is because we can compress liquid we can compress gas but we can't compress the solid because already space is occupied by the molecules there is no gap between the molecules force of attraction is maximum compressibility is minimum we can't compress the solid should we can't compress this volume is fixed example solid there are many examples stone span and gold silver these are the example of now the composition of matter Mat all matter has con all matter consists of very tiny particles. These particles are called atoms. Whether gas, liquid, or solid, they are made up of small particles. Now, if the particles are of similar kind or different kind in any matter, on the basis of that, the matter is divided into three categories: elements, compound, and mixture. in element in element all the particles all the atoms or molecules are of similar kind if we see gold in gold matter all the particles all the atoms are of gold only if we take silver in the silver all atoms are of silver and all are alike in nature or is in element so element is made up of similar kind of atoms 
बट कंपाउंड कंपाउंड आर मेड अप ऑफ डिफरेंट काइंड ऑफ एटम्स बट द प्रपोर्शन और द रेशो ऑफ एटम्स इन अ कंपाउंड इज फिक्सड लाइक वॉटर इज अ कंपाउंड वॉटर इज मेड अप ऑफ हाइड्रोजन एंड ऑक्सीजन हाइड्रोजन एंड ऑक्सीजन हाइड्रोजन एटम्स आर टू एंड ऑक्सीजन एटम इज वन इन वाटर मॉलिक्यूल फॉर्मूला ऑफ वाटर इज एच टू ओ एंड एच टू ओ देर आर टू हाइड्रोजन एंड वन ऑक्सीजन इट इज फिक्सड वेदर वी प्रिपेयर वाटर इन द लैब और वी गेट इट फ्रॉम वेल और वी गेट इट फ्रॉम पोन्ड or from get any sources we uh, the ratio of h and o is always same in water or in any compound co2 co2 is also example of compound one carbon two oxygen it is always fixed one is to two but in mixture in mixture the ratio is not fixed the constituent which are present in the mixture their ratio is not fixed it is variable like our blood our blood is a mixture two person cannot have the same in blood in their blood like milk milk is a mixture the composition of milk of cow will be different the composition of milk from other cow so air is a mixture air is a mixture we take the sample of air from one place and another sample we take from another place the composition will be different because the ratio is not fixed in mixture elements have symbol compound say formula and mixture have neither symbol nor formula